Hi, hello, YouTube land! Check your clocks because it's amateur over time! Welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles 2! In the last episode, uh, it was kind of a defeat by uh, Lila slash Dark Poppy. She kept pummeling us, destroying us with bitey bombs and pup punches and rocket kicks, mostly rocket kicks. That was like the weakness of our little party here. But I've been trying off camera and to no avail, I've still been getting the tar kicked out of me. I, this is like, if I, if I had to count this right now, me recording, this would be attempt number 20. <laughs> so at this point, I can't take it anymore. So I decided to make this easier on all of us and make my sanity even a little bit like <laughs> normal. I decided to turn the game game settings to easy. <laughs> Hopefully, this will make the game just a little bit easier, and then when I find it getting too easy, I can always switch back to normal. So, there's nothing really changey here, but I'm putting it to easy. <laughs> I just can't do it no more. <laughs> so, just for the sake of just getting through the game, my god, this will be hopefully not as much of a train wreck as before. Where is, isn't there supposed to be someone like walking by? No? Okay, cool. Oh my God, she's still level 29 though. So uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and try to beat this, <laughs> this monstrosity known as Lila. And hopefully we'll, we'll do this. This is still, hopefully not gonna wreck me. So before I jump in again, leave a like for you know who, Rex, Mithra, Pyra, Poppy, the whole party. Oh god, someone's coming. Okay, we're gonna have to go now. Who did I who should I be? Percival, why not? Go for it. Oh god. And she already smacked me one. That's great. Oh god. This is I'm scared. <laughs> I'm actually scared. See, look at this rocket kick already. Oh my god. Bitey bombs. Everything. Hopefully this changes things, because if not, then I still need to do something with my stuff. Yeah, the rocket kick. Look at me, I'm already down. Mithra, please. Oh, Lord. Blade affinity down. What? Oh, God. Look at me, I'm already about to die. <laughs> Why? Wake me up. Thank you. See, did you see that right now? The rocket kick finished me off again. I don't know why this happens. Oh, God. Okay. Focus, focus, focus. Missile circus, that's a new one. Ugh. Ether barrier, what does that do? Oh, she's invincible to everything. I forgot about that. Rock, need help. Thank you. Maybe we should pop in Percival at some point. Counter pup punch. Percival, help. Evade. Do something. There we go. Excellent. Okay. Oh god, the rocket kick. No. Mithra. I need Mithra. Alright. Hopefully this will do something. Dynamite pub punch. Oh my god. No, not the rocket kick. That's the evil move. Ooh, I can topple her. Oh yeah, she's invincible. Crap. <laughs> yes. She got toppled anyway. Uh, kill her. Do something. Hit it. There we go. No more bitey bombs. First of all, did I do my art? Okay, this is this is actually going good. <laughs> Thank God for easy mode. <laughs> oh boy. Dark tide. I still don't know what element this is supposed to be. Is it supposed to be like darkness? I, ow, I have no idea. Splash hazard, do something. Splash hazard! I missed. Oh my god, what is... Oh, she got toppled. Oh, I killed her <laughs> with the water. That's cool. Thank god. Oh my lord. Thank you. <laughs> Falling, switching to strategic retreat mode. Don't oh, so you just gonna run just after that? After the Wait! After the many attempts 
of beating you, you just kind of run. <laughs> uh, I feel so brokenhearted after that now. That 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 wasn't worth it. <laughs> that was not worth it. Oh man. Ah, that's so. Oh, that makes me angry. All right, now where do I go? Oh my god. Oh, we're Percival still. I guess that's fine. Who am I attacking? Oh, I'm attacking this dude. Why are you running? <laughs> Look at him. He's running. Why are you running? Come here. Okay, he's getting he's getting people. I'm gonna run away too. Forget you. Nope, nope, no. Help, help, <laughs> help. Where do I even go? Ah, escape route, my favorite. You'll never take me alive. Ha, 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 Try to catch me now. That's another guy. <laughs> We're gonna die. <laughs> yeah, I'm a, I'm a dude on the run. Oh, that's not good. Hey. You'll never catch me now. Where I don't even know where I'm going. Once again, these guys like to throw me off. <gasps> Escape route. Later, suckers. <laughs> Pursue Lila at the bridge. Got it. <laughs> oh, I actually did escape him. Cool. All right. So, uh, this is not according to plan. <laughs> so, I guess I could skip travel, huh? I don't know why I was not thinking that. Uh, back here. That was hilarious. <laughs> they always throw me off of my game. Yeah! Alright, this is... Oh, wow, this is very far away from my <laughs> my objective. I gotta find a bridge. But what bridge? Oh, this is a side quest. Pidede? Pidede? Whatever your name is. Ah, why army of more day not move speedy? If things keep go like this, my precious cargo spoil before I reach capital. Something bothering, friend? Oh, what might I see if not driver with time to spare? Dear driver, me have a request. Toro want more info. Stuff that arrive here in port at Anagonim. I don't even know what that meant. Says, get taken into Alba. Oh my god. Kavanik via downtown High Street over yon. But right now, cargo transportation zone infested with land vault and nukes. Nuke Skeeter? <laughs> What kind of name? <laughs> and Nuke Skeeter. <laughs> Not safe for working. I asked our Danian soldiers there to help with mop up, but it looked like it takes some time still. Make long story short, friends look like they ready to go anytime, so today they ask for friends for help. If friends perform in speedy manner, friends receive ample reward. It's very good deal, yes? Tora want to help out? Should be easy for Tora and friends. Speedy decision. Wonderful. Well then, please go beat up Nasty Land Wolf and Nuke Skeeter in Cargo Transportation Zone. Well then, please proceed. Speedily. I'll do what I can. Alright, road to the capital. That's the side quest. Maybe I'll do it. Who knows? But we'll see. We'll see. But as of now, I gotta start this whole journey over. Because the blasted Ardanian soldiers like to throw me off my game and throw me off the bridge. Such is life for, uh... An outlaw such as me, living a dangerous life. What here? Yay, we've got more stuff. Oh, oh, is that part of the thing? Okay. Ah, that's a noob skeeter. Okay. Time to die. Sure. Of course I can. <laughs> Topple it? Oh wait, I'm not Mithra. I gotta use my other stuff. Oh, there's a bunch of noob skeeters. Uh, I can't switch yet. Well, that's one down. Now we need more. Rock. Oh, man. Butterfly powder? What does that do? That's one more. Yeah! I need Mithra. There we go. Sword bash, and then let's use that little explosion of light. Woo! So no uppy. Yeah! Oh my god, there's a lot of nuke skeeters. Too many nuke skeeters. Isn't my aren't I supposed to be like fighting some sort of wolf or something? Rolling smash. Ooh, recover recharge too. That's good, that's really good. Yes, 
Ooh, I leveled up. That's what I'm talking about. Level 31. Yeah, boy. Oh my god, Wolfric, no. <laughs> oh, Lord, Wolfric's tearing him up. Oh my god. Yay. Oh, that's where this thing's coming from. Kill it. Why not? Rolling smash. Explosion of light. Boom. Okay. Alright, that was it. Cool. Alright. Oh, there's more nuke skeeters. There's a lot of nuke skeeters. Well, I gotta lure it first. Hold on. Let me put that back. Hey, boy. Look at me. The, wrong guy. Run. <laughs> wrong guy. <laughs> That's not what I wanted to fight. Wait. I don't mean it. Oh, God, soldiers. Hope you don't mind me just draw, drawing in a sandy bunnet. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, you guys are actually good guys. You're not going to hurt me. Thank you. All right, let's try again with uh, the new Skeeter. Minor distraction. <laughs> just a minor... Oh, oh, oh. Land wolves? Yeah, land wolves. Let's kill them. I want to use... Oh, I can't use Mithra. There we go. Plunging Fang. Ugh. There we go. Cut them up. I feel like this takes too long, though. I might need. I like. I might need some more power or something. I might be missing something here. There we go. Mithra. Yay. Beast Howl. Oh, no, he's bringing in more people. That's what that does. That's I know exactly what that does. Ooh, lots of stuff falling all over the place. Which is why everybody must die. It's for the sake of a no pond. Oh, God, here comes Wolfric. <laughs> Every time. Blast of light. Poof. Oh, it has knockback to it. I like it. Oh my god, Wolfric, why? 2005? Dang. He's pretty good. Much obliged. Nice. Maybe if he could howl in for another wolf, maybe, then this would be great. One more blast of light, please. Nice. Kill it. But I still got like a couple more noob skeeters out there that I gotta grab. Sword Bash. Don't you rock next. Alright. Uh. Uh. Oh my god. Oh, B. Got it. Excellent. This is, this is easy stuff. Percival next. Break down. Yeah, boy. Hey. Ray of punishment. What does that mean? Alright. I think that's some voles. Now we just need that nuke skeeter. Come here. Yeah, I got him. <laughs> what a shot. Fight me, mate. Evasion. Die. Die. Should we do a chain attack just to, like, make it quick and painful? I feel like we should tell to do that, but... Hey! There we go, we did it! That's all the stuff. Alright, let's go talk to, um... What's-his-face? What was we here? Yay! Alright, let's run back down. Talk to this Nopon, and then hopefully head back to our objective. That was just a little minor distraction. I didn't expect it to be so close to the... Uh, the objective. But we shall do it. Don't worry, guys. And all for the sake of easiness. <laughs> God, I still feel, like, down that that happened. After the many times I've lost to Lila, and then after the one time I beat her, she wants to take off. Oh, oh, friends return. Everything should be fine now. Oh, oh, capable driver really in class of own when it comes to speediness. Time is money. That means speed is more money. Value of life measured by contents of bank account, meh. Is that right? And so, having said why saying, 
P-Day Day departs speedily to deliver wares of Alaba Kavanic. No time for idle prattle. Thanks, friends. You're welcome. All right, road to the capital. Complete. Noise. Going, oh, I don't really get that much experience, but I did get a lot of gold from it. Now that he's sure to, now that he's sure the road to Alba Kavang is safe, Pidede is making his way to the capital with his weight, with his wares. I thought it said wages. All right, that's good enough for me. Another thing that I should keep in mind too is that uh, my Merc group. I don't even know I have deployed one out yet, but yeah, I got to keep in mind about the Merc, the mercenary stuff that I can just do for like bonus experience, which means also awakening more blades. But at the time being, I only have Rex and Nia. I probably need more people, if I ever get more people, to um, do the Awakening of Blades. Because I feel like I have a lot in my arsenal. I got a lot of common core crystals that I need to be popping out so far. But, such is life. Did I go up here? I think I did. Press the button. No button. Hello. There we go. Everyone's in. Cool. Let me switch that to... Uh, I want to switch my my blade. Percival's kind of cool and all, but we need the Mithra. Come on, Mithra, pop out, do something. Percival is still. Oh no! <laughs> oh, they're looking for me. Nope. It's the Jeepers, fellas. It's the cops. You'll never spot me. Dude, they are scoping the area. All right. Let's see. I gotta pull a little sneaky, wee re sneaky Ricky over here. Switch, rock. There we go. There is Mithra. All right, Mithra, follow my lead. We shall ease our way out of here. See what I tell you? Simple. Now let's head over here. This is where she went. I, I, I highly doubt this. Oh, I don't. I don't even know anymore. Hello, Dark Puppy. She's gone. Either friend is leaving lost. It seems she has escaped. No, oh well. Lila. Let's keep moving. <laughs> so that was his dad's project? Grandpa Pon Susu and Dada Pon Tatazo were working on her. Her name was Lila. Grandpa Pon and Dada Pon and Tora all wanted to become driver. So that was the first project then. However, not single one of us have potential. Uh, what's happening? So, we decide to work together and make artificial blade. Blade even we can use. That's cool. So, why bake Poppy then? But then... Oh, I guess it's gonna tell me why. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> a Punopan with a gun. Yikes. <gasps> he just, oh my god, what did I just witness? <laughs> you must run, Tora. Take this and go. Someday you'll finish what we started. Oh my god, he's getting shot. After that, Tora hide out in Torigog City. Making Poppy based on blueprints and ether furnace that upon left for Tora. Well, that answered my question. Don't you have any idea who the attackers were? Tora not know who, but they definitely wanted to steal Lila. I mean, I just saw a fuzzball with a gun. This is serious. How she ends up here in the Empire? It looked like they were Imperial soldiers after that. Maybe she gained sentience. Confusing. What's that? When bad guys attacked the lab, Lila was not finished. There's only one who could finish making Lila. Dad upon Tatazo. Which means the dad's still alive. Must still be alive somewhere. Yeah, I do remember seeing a weird no pun like looking around after Lila was like shown. Oh God! It's the caps again. <laughs> Leave me alone. 
Oh, it's Morag. And Blind Fire Lady. What's up? That's my name. Not really. Wait, wrong one. No, 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 no. Oh, great. That's not what? Yeah, you do. Okay, don't listen to us. Pull out the sword. Go for it. <laughs> no one likes to listen to people anymore in this game. Just fight me. Pull out swords and no pawns with guns. Sure. Oh, God. All right. Come on, pull out the sword, Rex. <laughs> Thank you. All right, we got to be careful now. I bet you if I did this on normal, this would be intimidating as all get out. So we're gonna do a sword bash. I'm already about to die, by the way. So, anchor shot. <laughs> Grab those. Aqua. Ugh. Maybe I should take care of the, uh, the soldiers first. I mean, that's what you would usually do, if anything. First of all. All right, dual slash that guy, or girl. Yeah. Excellent. Oh, grab it, grab it. Well, we're kind of getting more egg down a little bit, so this is good. All right, dynamic. Go for radiance. What's that mean? Rock. Why? I think one of them went down. I don't know yet, but where is everybody? I have no idea. Everyone's like everywhere. Wait, I'm fro- oh, I'm toppled. Got it. <laughs> Get up, Rex. Ah. Wild sight. Thank you. Now we got the evasion. Uh, uh, Mithra. Rolling smash. What is that? Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know what just happened. A bunch of blue fire went everywhere. Crazy light, go. Uh, there we go. Ow. Stop it. Sword. Bash. Stone. Uh, we're gonna use Percival. Get her. Oh god, Wolfric. Oh my god, Wolfric. So much destruction with you. Yeah. Arrow blade. Oh god, who's down? Oh, that's Nia. Oh my god, get up, get up, get up, get up. Rex, Rex. Oh lord, revive him. Yeah. Yikes on trikes. Oh, I'm dead. I was too late on saving Nia. We're so close. <laughs> what? No, no Hellfire. I'm trying to win. Who am I aiming for now? <laughs> Stone, do something. Uh, I, I can't, I can't do any other blades right now. Rock. Wait. Oh, that's it. Thank God. Whew. That was, uh, intense. <laughs> Still intense. Nah, it's just on easy mode, that's all. I can't answer that for you. Right? Listen. <laughs> That's what all I wanted to know. Oh my god. Don't. What are. Don't. She's turning her swords into whips. Stop it. <laughs> I'm trying to explain. After this foresight, I'll switch to Pyra. Understood. That's pretty cool how we can see that. That's legit. <laughs> Yeah, he dodged it. Now with the Pyra.
Yeah, take the fire. You know, you need water. That's what you need. Because blind fire lady over here. Oh, boy. No. Please be the dad. I okay. I have no idea who you are. To infiltrate the facility and attack your soldiers. Well, some of them, but not the majority. <laughs> I kind of ran from them most of the time. Then the culprit behind the attack was Dark Puppy. Was not the artificial blade standing here now. Is that right? No. They very similar, but not the same. No, they're not. I saw her with own eyes. I had a feeling we were being watched since our arrival. I'm quite sorry for causing concern. You better be. Why did you step up before? Auditing Argentum Trade Guild. Ah, so you were keeping an eye on us because we came in on a guild ship. How ironic that your suspicion should happen to prove our innocence. It appears I was too hasty in judging you. <laughs> I should not have attacked you so suddenly. My apologies. You better be sorry. <laughs> I mean, of course, apology That's accepted. Fine. Nobody got hurt in the end. I'm just glad it all got cleared up now. An apology from the illustrious Flamebringer, a rare reward in itself. I'm guessing she's the Flamebringer. I'm not happy. Should get years supply of tasty sausages as compensation. Okay, I'm going with Tora here. Shush! <laughs> I want some food for this. I will do what I can within my own means to compensate you. Yay! <laughs> By the way, the culprit who fled the scene. Might I ask what manner of connection you have with them? Duh. Tell me all. None. Okay, back to Mithra. No, I... I uh, I'm so confused. <laughs> it seems it would be best for all of us. If we work together for the moment. Okay. Us work with you. I'm fine with it, as long as she's not hurting me. My goal is to capture the artificial blade and track down the criminals behind its actions. And from what you just told me, those I seek likely have Tora's father held captive. That's a good thing. Would you not say our interests align? I do. Let's work with her. Uh, I guess so. Just say yes. Well, it's definitely better to have her working with us than against us. Yes, go with Mithra. You and you get to have Blind Fire Lady. I forgot your name. <laughs> it's just, you stand out with the eyes closed and everything. Good man. We burn this place to the ground. Uh. I am honored that the Aegis herself thinks so highly of me. Uh. You may not remember it, but... I faced you a few times before. Let's just say it wasn't easy. Oh, really? But that's a story for another time. What do you say, guys? I can't deny I'd rather avoid making an enemy of them. I'm down. See, Tor and Poppy are down. I'm down. All right, then. Go for it. So, from this moment on, I suppose we're allies. Hey, handshake, please. That's the respect. Thank you. Even curly haired no pawn over there is kind of happy about this. Nice. We did it. We did it. We got another For friend. A moment, I will return to the palace. If you learn anything new, please send word. I'll try. I will instruct the palace guards to allow you audience with me. Woo! Alright. So no one's gonna chase me anymore? <laughs> Thank God. I'm so done being an outlaw. <laughs> oh man. Yay, we're friends now. Are you sure you wish to partner yourself with these people? Please say yes. Just as you were not using your full strength, neither still were they. Yet you saw the power they demonstrated. How could I not feel intrigued? Drawn by your driver instincts? Something like that. And besides... Hmm. 
I get the feeling that if I stay near that boy, I might bear witness to something quite extraordinary. Like what? Him growing taller? <laughs> I mean, that's the most logical one I can see. It sounds like you had quite the adventure. But it's good that you work things out. Anyway, we'll see if we can track Lila down somehow ourselves. We still gotta find her. I too will see if I can find any leads. She ain't gonna beat me up anymore, right? Maybe we're friends, we'll find Professor Tatazo. Okay. So I guess we're just on a hunt for Lila now. Right then, so how are we supposed to track down this Lila? Can we not just ask around in the streets like we usually do? Might not be that helpful. It was night when it happened, so I doubt any many people saw her. Meh meh meh, time for Tora to show genius skills. You have some kind of idea, Tora? Tora sure must be that upon who finished building Lila. Yes, you told us as much as last night. And Poppy made based on blueprints Tora got from Datapon. So Lila and Poppy use basically same design. Which could mean they are constructed from very similar materials? Exactly yes. Oh, I get it. If we ask around to find out who's been buying those materials from Mo Ardain, it might lead us to whoever built her. Ray a good suggestion from Master Pod. So, Tora, what materials exactly would they need to make an artificial blade? Well, ether furnace is obvious, but apart from that, also need Tetra Circle, Snake Joint, Black Ash, Delta Vessel, Rabbit Diode, Morph Orb, Phototonic Coil, Fairy Tail Belt Pulley, Arc Indicator, Insect Chip, Perfect Range Sensor, Beyond Connector. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Nobody's gonna be able to remember all that. Tora, not even say one thirteenth of this yet. Oh my god, there's a lot of parts. There were a couple of names in there that sounded familiar, though. That Beyond Connector was meant to be easy to salvage around Gorma, right? Actually, it's almost impossible to find anywhere other than Gorma around this season. So whoever we're looking for would have to import them from Gorma, am I right? Perhaps we might find some leads at Port Agnes. We won't. We don't have much else to go on, so it's worth a try. Okay, Lila's location received. All right, so that's the main quest for this one. All right. Oh boy, Noponic Storm. Oh yeah, I should be checking up on this stuff. Go to Port Agnes for gather information, which is god far away. Oh, it's finally daytime now. Thank goodness. Whoa, I didn't see this in the daytime. You're a big boy. I can't get hurt, thank goodness. What is... Whoa, this looks like something that just, like, dropped from Halo. <laughs> or something. That's legit. So this is the music. I'm listening to the music right now. This is pretty good, actually. The good soundtrack. So this is more ordained to the daytime, thank God. Ooh, heart to heart. What's this do? Check. Let's play ball. I don't want to play ball. I want a heart to heart. Oh, they're talking. It's kind of soft, though. I see him. Let's keep our distance, yeah? Let's let sleeping lovers lie. Hey, cool. Be not alarmed. The troops that captured us were our daily military guests. But from the Gormati regiment. I don't get it. What's happening? What? So I'm guess so what I'm guess getting from this right now, I guess he listened in on something? Okay. What's the difference? Yeah. Beyond the bridge is Hard A Pass, the Imperial residence. Therefore. Oh, I've got it. The palace guards belong to a different unit. Of course. Huh? <laughs> Inquisitor, the Flame Bringer herself. Wow, 
I don't follow. Yeah, I'm going with Nia here. I have not. What else should I ask? Nia, how was Tor Torna organized? Any uh, got any good ones, Dromark? Uh, Tiger Boy or Nia? Tiger Boy or Nia? T I like them both though. <laughs> Nia and Tiger Boy get along real good. Uh, Nia, how was Torna organized? Why not? <laughs> Ruska dumplings, what are those? <laughs> do, do it. I'm down. <laughs> Tiger Boy's not satisfied. I've... Yeah, I'll be fine. It's Ruska dumplings. You gotta try everything once. Dromark's wisdom complete. Okay. I guess. So... Now what? Oh, I just keep going. Dude, I am loving more ordained in the daytime. This music is actually kicking. It's kind of like army-ish, actually. I like it. Army music. Pretty majestic. Alright, uh, where am I going? Back to the port. Um, are you sure this is a good idea to be dropping down from that height? Maybe it will take me down, unless I can skip travel and not be an idiot. Let's see. Anything? Travel this destination? No. Lower level. How about the- Oh, it's right there! <laughs> it's actually at the very start. Okay. That's cool. Ooh. There's another big old boy. Alright, where? Right here. Perry Perry, what's up? Huh? You're Perry Perry, right? Ah, Rex. Such coincidence to meet here. You haven't brought any cargo from Gormont, have you? Have so. Even though you were Argentum, came from Argentum to Gormod, then Gormod to Moradain. Oh, I see. I guess that makes sense. Then Tora has something to ask Perry Perry. Did Perry Perry transport large quantity of Beyond Connector recently? Meh meh meh. Talking about contents of shipment is violation of trade confidentiality. Come on, we really need to know this. Ah, if it's request from Rex, Perry Perry cannot refuse. Perry Perry carried Beyond Connector in yellow barrels. How many? At least ten, Perry Perry think. That's got to be it. Perry Perry know where shipment for? Sadly not having that information, job was only to bring cargo to port. But cargo unloaded here, always taken off towards city. Maybe friends find cargo at inspection point near elevator. Only if receipt not picked up yet, of course. Alright, we'll have a look. Thanks, Perry Perry. Alright, so we got some information. No pun wisdom. Ooh. Lila's location. Go to the elevator that leads to more Ardane's capital and search for yellow, yellow barrels. Okay. Ugh. <laughs> I gotta look for parts. This is unbelievable. But I suppose it's worth it. Going up. This looks, this looks like a desert now, actually. Like, in, at night, this looked completely different. But now I'm seeing it, this looks way desertish. But we'll just keep going. Dude, that, that's a pretty good backdrop right there. <laughs> this place is beautiful, <laughs> considering how desertish it looks. Alright, so I'm gonna be finding metal barrels. I don't gotta fight no nuke skeeters or anything, do I? I hope not. Ah, my dear soldier friends. Oh, the industrialist on the left. Okay, don't know what that meant. Yellow barrels, yellow barrels. They could be anywhere, yellow barrels. Ooh, fuzzy boys. Ugh, sorry, got distracted. <laughs> uh, they around, are they around here somewhere? 
I might, uh, excuse me, I might be going the wrong way because I, I think I was right there, but we'll see. Yeah. Come on, let me out. Let me out. Let me out. All right. Yeah, I went the wrong way. <laughs> I gotta go back down. Press the button. Boink. All right, guys. This is, uh, sorry for the minor setback. I think Mithra's stuck on the wall. Thank you. Ding, ding. All right. All right, so where are these barrels at? That's not a barrel. That looks like manure, actually. Where? Oh, it's right here. Yellow barrels. You see any? Yellow barrels. Yellow barrels. I can't see any. Hmm. What if there's some over there the first time we came here? Come to think of it, I do recall something of that nature. According to memory of Poppy, yellow barrels were definitely there. So that means someone must have picked them up already. I can only assume as much. Well, that leaves us without any leads. Oh man. Tora, I'm not about to give up so easy. Tora, remember there is junk shop in Alba Kavanik. We gas and finfo there. Another rare good suggestion from Master Pond. A junk shop, huh? Yeah, they might know a thing or two about parts for the artificial blades. Then what are we waiting for? Alright, so... I guess now we're gonna head over to... A junk shop. <laughs> Lila's location. Go to a shopping district in more ordained and speak with the owner of the recycling shop. Oh my god. Well, I guess I'll just... End it right here, guys. Because we ran out of time for more Xenoblade action. So I'm going to leave it off here. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a like. Also, comment and subscribe to get new feed on videos. And become a member of the Cuckoo Crew today. Also, be sure to follow me on Twitter. So you can recommend any video games you want me to play or chat. Your preference. And also, if you subscribe, be sure to tap that bell to get notifications on videos. So you'll never miss one from me ever again. But that's going to be it from Xenoblade Chronicles 2. In the next episode, we'll search for Lila. And hopefully, she joins our team, maybe. And that's pretty much it, really. Bolrag's with us now. Thank God. No more fighting soldiers. I'm so done being an outlaw and a criminal. <laughs> Just always outrunning the police and the soldiers and everything. So I will see you then in this exciting game. I can't wait. It's going to be so much fun. Amateur out. Oh, that was a terrible whistle. Better. <laughs>